Hey guys, so I think this will be my last one on this response subject from Shalev's video. But maybe not, because that video got me pretty fired up in a good way. Uh, I was raised in a family where we really believed we were different and we believed we were better than other people, or at least... I thought I was better than other people, which is funny because I, I had a lot of challenges and, and difficulties. And I think part of the reason at least I wanted to believe I was better than other people is because it was a survival technique. You know, I, I had all the other kinds of difficulties. And so in order to compensate, maybe I thought I was better than other people. But I was also taught that I was better on some level and I was taught that you know certain people have special places in heaven you know um, Jewish people have a special place in heaven can you imagine and it's easy to imagine and it's sad that it's easy to imagine because um, I was also raised that you know people who were different were scary and we can't trust them so I grew up with a lot of uh, really bad values in that way also money was very important um, and it was really more important than anything else or financial security maybe not money itself but financial security was extremely important and you had to do whatever you have to do in order to uh, attain financial security. Uh, I was told uh, many times that it didn't matter if I had to work on Shabbat or Holy Days. That didn't matter. It was more important to to have money and to be secure and to, and to take care of your family. And, you know, some of that, of course, is good. Who doesn't want to take care of their family? But other aspects of that are not good so it's really hard for me uh, because I know I was raised with some things that were wrong and I'm ashamed of it I'll be honest with you it's very hard for me to think about it and talk about it and I'm working through it and I'm asking Hashem to help me but I'll be honest with you guys I'm ashamed of most of how I was brought up um, and I still don't have a good relationship with some of my family because of it I have other family relations that are good and then some that aren't so good so all these things factor in to people's perception and like I said in the first part Every group has their difficulties, their idiosyncrasies. I've had people of other religions be rude to me. And of course, I told you a few weeks ago that one guy was telling me I'm going to hell because I don't believe his way. And, you know, everybody has their difficulties. Everybody has their, every group, every religion, every group has their difficulties guys I'm sorry I'm repeating myself and the, the 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 key is to be aware of that in yourself and ask Hashem to help you with it and then ask Hashem to help you be the person that you really need to be for yourself and for other people because you know Again, I've had people of every group be unkind to me at different points. The challenge is also to say, hey, that's an individual. Maybe they're not having a great day. Maybe something's going on in their life that's not great. Maybe I can help them. Maybe I can't. Maybe the best way to help them is just to smile. Give them a smile and say, have a good day. I hope it gets better. You know, let me know if I can help or if I can't, it's okay. But most of it is about judging each person favorably 
and then making it an individual situation, not making a blanket statement. All, all of these people are this way and all of those people are this way. Be careful, guys. We can't do that. We can't do that. We can't do that. And I have been disappointed by my own family, by my own people, just as much as I've been disappointed by people that I didn't know at all. And again, this also goes back to what I said. When you have those little sufferings, just try your best to say, Thank you, Hashem. Thank you, Hashem, for that little suffering. That person didn't smile at me in the cashier line. That person was unkind to me for whatever reason. Just be kind, guys. Do your best. Be kind. Love yourself. And it's easier to love other people when you love yourself. So love yourself more. Connect to Hashem more. And keep going, guys. We're going to make it. Maybe I'll have more to say today, but maybe not. I hope this has been helpful, guys. I love you all very much. Thank you. Goodbye. Ha, <laughs>